guys welcome back to my channel so i sent an email out to my email subscribers not too long ago asking to see like what kind of content you guys wanted to see and one of the things that i got sent back to me um were questions just about like what kind of beauty products i use and what kind of makeup i use and quite honestly i don't use a ton of stuff so it's not like there's going to be a ton of content that i can make for you guys on this subject but i did want to film a video on all of the ColourPop um, lippy sticks and lip products that I use that I love because if there is one brand of like lipsticks or lip glosses that I use it is ColourPop. I honestly like the color of my lips so I don't know maybe that makes me weird but I don't really like using lip products all the time like I don't have to use a lipstick to leave the house. I can very easily wear nothing put a little bit of Aquaphor just so that my lips don't get chapped and that's about it but there are some days when I'm like, okay, like let me like step up my game a little bit. Let me like try to be somewhat of an adult and put on some lipstick. And when I um, when I do, I tend to reach for these ColourPop lippy sticks. They're super cheap. They're easy to apply, and I have like a whole bunch of shades of them because I think during Christmas they did like a sale where they were like I don't know like three bucks each or something. So I was like, all right, perfect opportunity to buy a whole ton of them. So I'm going to be showing them to you, doing some swatches on my lips so you guys can see them and I don't know I hope you like this okay so these are gonna be like in no particular order but I'm gonna try to do some of these nude ones first so that way it's easier to like take them off so this is Contempo and again I'm gonna try to do this as quick as possible so I apologize if I'm not gonna do like perfect lip swatches but at least you get an idea of what this color looks like on someone with my skin tone it's got like a rosy pink undertone okay now this one that I'm wearing is Cami all right, so this one is Aquarius and it's a little bit too um, like nude for my taste. I usually go for lip colors that have like a little bit more of like a rose undertone in them. So it's a little bit too nude, but it's still really pretty. All right, so the one I'm wearing now is Cookie and I feel like this is also like another nude, but it's a little bit more brown. All right, so honestly, this is one of my favorites. It's called Lumiere. Um, I'm pretty sure it's um, a color that Kathleen Lights made with ColourPop. It's very rosy and I just, I love it. So yeah, this is definitely a color that I reach for a lot. It's still kind of nude, but it's got like, I don't know, it's got some color in it and I don't know, it doesn't look too shocking and it's not something that makes me feel like I don't know, like I'm trying too hard or something. All right, I swear if somebody comments that I don't know how to put on lipstick or that my lips look crooked, I know, I know they look crooked because I'm doing this super fast before um, my baby wakes up. And for the life of me, I still, I'm 27 years old and I cannot put on lipstick in like one shot. I don't know, maybe I'll get better in time. I probably need lip liner, but whatever, that's not the point. The point is to show you what these colors look like. So this one's really fun and it's called I Heart This with the actual heart, like the symbol of a heart. And it's a really like reddish, pinkish, but I really like it. And when I feel like dressing up and feeling a little girly, I'll definitely put this one on. All right, so my light is dying. It's like almost five o'clock. So I'm gonna try to make this as quick as possible. But this one is called Trust Me. And I would say it's probably the most real red that I have in my collection. Um, the one that I tried on before, the I Heart This, that one's a little bit more pink. This one's the most true red. And then I'm gonna try one, um, the next one is called Frenchie, which is a little bit more orange. So when I'm going for like a real red, this is the one that I will reach for. Don't mind all the markings on me. All right, so like I said, this one is called Frenchie and it's a little bit more orange. It's a little bit more like fire truck red as opposed to like a deep true red. It's still really pretty though. I just don't wear this one as much as probably the other ones. Okay, so this one is called um, New Rules and it's a little bit more purple. It's definitely not a red of any kind. I think it's more of like a mauve -y purple. I still think it's really pretty and it's probably like a good shade like for the fall, for the winter. I know sometimes in that season, like the really dark purple lipstick, the ones that are like almost black, um, those are normally really trendy. I'm not that brave. I wish I was, I'm not that brave. So this is probably a color that I would go for if I'm looking for a little bit more of like a fall look. All right, so this is the last one that I'm gonna show you guys. This one that I'm wearing is called Bichette. I bought it because I really like the name, but I would say it's more of like a, 
I don't know, like a maroonish color. Um, I don't know, I think it's a really sexy color, definitely good for nighttime. And I don't know, I just feel a little sexier when I'm wearing this one. All right, you guys, so that's it for today's video because legit, like, I have no more light. I have no more light, I cannot film, especially a makeup video. So I apologize if the lighting is all screwed up, but um, I hope that you like this review. I get, I tend to get sent a lot of products and I'm hoping to be able to review them on camera for you guys. Um, but keep in mind, I'm not, I'm not a makeup artist. I'm just a regular everyday girl. Now I'm a mom, so I have very limited time. So I will show you things, but I am not a professional by any means. So that is the disclaimer that I'm going to make. So if you like these kind of videos, I'd appreciate it if you'd give this one a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.